ranting about the world, ranting about the world, ranting, ranting, ranting about the world, ranting about the world, ranting, ranting. Okay, I'm gonna rant about the world with this. Yes, this. This is the Rising of the Phoenix, something I wrote five years ago, and now I'm going to read out loud today. Day. Our world is filled with many obstacles we all face an uncertain future. There's a need for change to provide a better tomorrow. Yes, a better tomorrow for our children. Our children. The things that I'm about to write are ideas, but not fully thought out ideas. Over time, I will improve these ideas. America is in need of a change. That's right. A great change. The government needs to be improved for the better of the world. We must focus on helping the world out and also helping those who can make a living in America. Money is the root. All evils! And this idea might seem radical to some, but we need to find an alternate way besides money. You see, money provokes greed, and greed leads to the mistreatment of others. Capitalism may seem good to some, but it has many flaws. To get more and more money and not care about those that are less fortunate than you? That is not good. Everyone deserves a fair shot at life. That's right. Everyone deserves a fair shot at life. 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 It is too much of a rich system where the poor get poorer and the rich get richer. Even though capitalism has given us stable governance, we must find another way of governing because the gap of the rich and poor will just grow larger and larger and larger and larger and larger and larger. Capitalism is destroying the world with its exploitation of natural resources and of the environment. Industries have made the world not as stable as it once was. Global warming and a melting of the polar ice caps and the endangering of animals over the years and are some of the examples of what the industries of capitalism are doing. That is not good. We must stop it. Somehow, some way, we must stop it. Somehow, some way. We must restore the earth to the way it was before capitalism started to destroy it. But it may be too late to restore the earth the way it was 200 years ago. I propose a solution to this problem that at this point will be looked upon as impossible and laughable. We keep the earth as stable as we can until we can start to move the people of the earth to space. Here's my plan. First, we must find a space foundation whose job will be to develop ships that can go to space and help develop colonies in space. When the colonies are ready to be inhabited, we will start to gradually send people into space. Only with colonies in space will mankind be able to escape the dangers of the Earth that are starting to develop. The space plan of mine might be might not be done for many years. I will most likely be dead when this plan is done. Even though this seems like a dream now, I think this can be an accomplishment one day. Developing new kinds of technology that would highly benefit mankind are very difficult because of the government interfering in anything that they feel would cost them business money and also that are very threatening to them. There are things that the government is hiding from us. Maybe they have some things that can help us, or maybe not. Anyways, we must see the danger of an invention in order to see if we can if we can keep it away from the public. All inventions that can help people will be allowed to be shown to the public. Any worker who loses their jobs due to these inventions will get a guaranteed job and a twenty percent lesser salary based on that their job level. That that doesn't make any sense. Anyways, there's the question in which what this new party will call 
will be called. Yes, there will be a new party, a new political party. They'll rise up, and this party's name will be the Phoenix National Party. The party symbol will be the Phoenix, because the Phoenix will show a rise from the ashes to something great. Hopefully, people will look patriotically upon this one day. This new society will be one where money will not mean as much to people as it does today. Our society will strive for the best for its people. We will give to the needy and help those that need to be helped. We will also seek knowledge in order to discover cures for many diseases and men many things that will benefit mankind. This society is in, is in need of better security over its country. We must provide the safety and security of all people because the, this government does not lo look up to the task of keeping this nation safe. We will offend the, the borders with very tight Security. We must do this in order to prevent terrorists, criminals, and drug dealers from entering our country and doing harm. Also, we want we do not want the government to monitor our privacy. Alright. This is a piece of shit.